Hello everybody and welcome back to the Excessive Gaming Channel and Euro Truck Simulator 2. Today we are back with our Let's Play series and episode number 31. So if you could quickly drop us a like, it would be much appreciated. And of course if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well. So, episode 31, what are we doing today? Well today we are here in Cambridge. And what we are going to be doing is some uh, small and simple jobs. We're also going to be spending a little bit of money and we're going to be upgrading the uh, base just here. As you can see on our money we've now got a ridiculous amount of money. Reason being is because something went drastically wrong with our profile swap over. We changed a couple of mods out and one of the uh, mods changed and it affected all of the money. So yeah, we've got a ridiculous amount of money, so please ignore the amount of money we've got. We are going to be spending some of it, like I say, doing the upgrade to the uh, unit here. Our little factory <coughs> is going to be fully upgraded today. We've purchased a couple of trucks as well, but uh, yeah, let's get started. So what we're going to do is go on to the company manager just down here, go to the garage manager. As you can see, Stockholm we purchased, that is uh, up at the top, we've bought three trucks for that garage at the moment. And what we have also done is had to dismiss the two drivers that we had. We've got two new drivers, but all of these are going to change once again, we're going to dismiss these as well. All the trucks themselves are going to be uh, dismissed as well and got rid of. We're going to have a massive uh, spending spree today. But anyway, so we're going to click on uh, Cambridge where we are. Uh, we can... Why isn't that letting us do that there? Oh, there we go. So yeah, click on Cambridge. We've got uh, Cambridge location is... Uh, Cambridge location? Garage location is in Cambridge. There we go. Spit our words out, we'll get it right in the end. Trucks in the garage at the moment are three. So what we're going to do, let's dismiss this worker first. We don't need that one. Dismiss that one. We're going to dismiss that one. And there we go. So we go back to the garage manager. Cambridge. And there we go. So we've got two trucks plus us and our truck. We've got uh, three spare trucks there. I'll say two spare trucks there. So yeah. Hired drivers one. Well, we've only got us at the moment. We're not exactly a hired driver, but there we go. So we're going to click the upgrade button. It's going to cost 100,000 to upgrade. We do that, and this should now just play a short uh, little clip of seeing the garage fully upgraded. There we go. So we've now got. Uh, Five garages, I believe. And we get extra office space, etc., all added on as well. So, what we're going to do, like I said, is get these garages fully upgraded. There's a lot more space inside. So, that's that upgraded to a large one. Can't upgrade it anymore. We can now purchase two more trucks for this one here which we will do at some point we're going to do the same with the one in uh, Stockholm as well we're going to go and upgrade that there we go. and once again it should play another sample video of what the uh, garage now looks like once it's finished loading So this is the uh, garage in Stockholm in Sweden, <coughs> slightly different styled building, you can see all the office space etc has all been uh, upgraded as well, so that can now hold five trucks. Is that one done in there. Okay, so that's the two garages done. We can get obviously more garages 
as we move on but we don't want to <coughs> excuse me we don't want to be doing too many just yet and as you can see we've got various trucks we want to uh, sell all these trucks I know that's given us extra money but what we are trying to do is spend money and by purchasing a brand new truck with all the upgrades etc what it's doing is uh, and that's of course our truck just there in fact ours has changed as well so we've, as you can see distance driven we've not driven this any miles so we need to uh, start putting some mileage on that one it's obviously not done any jobs but uh, <clears throat> yeah so today like I said a bit of a funny sort of episode it's going to be very much a, uh, <clears throat> a, a spending sort of thing although I think what we will do is get this let's get a small job on the go so we're going to go freight market we are here in Cambridge anyway Let's see what we've got from Cambridge. Let's do a small job and nip this one up to Birmingham. I think would be a quick start. We'll get that one done. Get back to the truck. Here we go. Get the handbrake off and off we go. So yeah, it's pretty much going to be setting us up once again got a fuel in station here as well so we're here in Cambridge we head off get this one collected spot a lag oh whoa 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 where are we going signaling left we don't need to be going left let's uh, crack ourselves on there we go this one up here where we're turning left So yeah, everything that we're doing is of course in line ready for the update of the trailer ownerships that we can do. <coughs> like I said, we did have a little mess around with some of the mods that we've currently got installed. And I think that's why, uh, where it's all gone wrong with the money, but never mind. So hit the enter key there, we're going to go freight market once again. And take this job just here. It's wood shavings is what we've got on. So I think... Uh, Stobart trailer, I think. In fact, it doesn't really matter, but they are all Stobart ones, they're all renewable energy. So we'll take that as is. I'm going to take that job. <clears throat> like I say, he's only going to Birmingham, so not too far to travel. combine over there <coughs> back that up there and there we go, couple that one up, get it all hooked up raising the trailer legs and off we can go do that let's uh, quickly get a screenshot for today as well <clears throat> like I say today is really all about uh, yeah it's all about just doing a few small jobs In fact, all this week is going to be about doing small jobs. Well, like I said, you're just going to have to ignore the money for the time being. We will get that one sorted out. On we shall go now. So yeah, on to Birmingham. Get underway. We can uh, enjoy the journey. But yeah, like I say, all the mods that we've currently got installed are 
now hopefully working properly the money situation will sort itself out we are doing a few little bits and pieces just to get that sorted out like I said the mods that was in the mods folder one of them got uh, muddled up and uh, it caused the save game to include it on and then what's happened is it's uh, edited the money which is really disappointing especially how much it's edited by we only had about 300,000 I believe we've now got 792 million so we do need to get that changed and like I say we will get it done very soon Like I say, the purposes of today is just going to be a small job around the United Kingdom. Like I say, Cambridge to Birmingham. Nice straightforward one. And what we will be doing is getting this truck sorted out as well because this has changed. As well, a couple of bits and pieces have changed on this one, especially the seat position that we had. as quick as we can. He's going to stop in front now. Go straight out. Not the ideal thing to do. Coming on to the M11 in a truck as well. But, uh, just want to go down the back here to explore this road because we've not been down this one yet. Do that at the same time, like I say. Just flying straight through. Straight out is what we like to see. fast lane because the left lane is going off that is going off uh, down to Felix of course on the A14 don't want to be heading that way plenty of uh, Eddie Stobart trucks and trailers around now I think what we need to do is get ourselves sorted out properly get the truck liveried up Ready Stobart one just there. A so, uh, bit of Eddie Stobart spying along these journeys now. <coughs> like I say, you do really see a lot of Eddie Stobart trucks in the United Kingdom as well. They are very much in Europe, not just settled in England, of course. If you don't know who Eddie Stobart are, they are one of the biggest hauliers around at the moment you've got other bigger brands as well what we are going to be doing is uh, hopefully livering some trucks up very soon to our own brand another Eddie Stobart just got past So yeah, and like we say, today, uh, episode 31 of our Euro Truck Let's Play series. We are doing Cambridge to Birmingham today. We've got uh, 18 tonnes of wood shavings on board it's going to Birmingham DHL. Uh, we've got 69 miles left to go, an hour and 32 minutes of journey time. And... Uh, 9 hours 44 minutes of drive time left so we've got plenty of time but, uh, yeah like I say we need to get as many of these done as we can gonna do some nice simple jobs this week so that we can get enough episodes out obviously time is against us once again with the recordings we are 
rather busy with a few other jobs, trying to catch up after a few weeks of the school holidays, etc. Luckily they are nearly finished. Another Eddie Stobart there on the right. Like I say, we are getting caught up with a few jobs now. Getting back on track with our recording schedule. It's going to be a little bit all over the place for the rest of this week. And hopefully next week we should be, like I say, back on track. Doesn't always uh, go to plan, of course. There's always something that crops up. So there's a couple of the mods have messed that money up. Hopefully we should now be uh, back on track with all the mods etc at the moment. So let's get off there a bit quick. Just want to head into this one because again it's another little slip road bit we've not discovered. Again just come around the back, fly straight through. diverting like that if we was uh, in real life. Straight out once again, that's nice. So what we want to quickly do is just pause that there look at the world map because this is going to take us into Birmingham but I think we can go in we've already been in that top bit of Birmingham up there so what I'm thinking is if we come off this road here it'll give us another road that we've explored then I think that uh, would be the best bet come in that way there looks uh, reasonable to me <clears throat> so get back on the road a little bit of uh, mileage to our journey because we shouldn't be going that way round but uh, turn off here like I say this uh, truck is absolutely flying though there and quite know what's going on. Like I say here we come into Birmingham. We are of course speeding. But it is getting the job done nice and quick which is what we wanted to do. 
Stobart pulling a Tesco wagon there. Turning right here are these lights. done as well. Round to the round to the right. Go past the man dealership. Oh, we're actually turning left into this yard just here. And there we go. So we go. We we'll go with the straightforward park on this one. Cable drum there. Oops, too far. There we go. Get that T key, trailer legs down, uncouple the car, and that is another job done. So, yeah, we've got another 7,196 euros there. Again, it's not going to make much difference to the actual uh, bank balance. <coughs> But, uh, like I say, we are going to get that sorted out down there. But anyway, that is uh, it for today's episode, episode 31, Cambridge to Birmingham. And uh, if you have enjoyed today's video, remember to drop us a like. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you are new. And if you share this video with family and friends or anybody else that you think may enjoy it would be very much appreciated. Well, I'd say that's going to be it. Thank you very much for watching, and we shall see you in the next one. Bye for now.